All right, everybody. So what I've done is I've taken one tablespoon of canola oil, set it on the surface. Then I have taken one teaspoon of our proprietary materials and put it on the top. And as you can see in this glass, it doesn't sink. It stays on top. Okay. What we have here, it's soaking it up. You can see the absorbency of this material. How absorbent it is. Let me see if I can zoom in. It's working. Leave it sitting on the top. It's so light it sits there. Holds oil and still sits there on the top. Let's do that to this one too. You can see that drop of oil. One tablespoon. This is one teaspoon of material. So you can see the difference. Okay, see how fast that goes to absorb that oil? It's absorbing it and soaking it in. Look at that. Now I can go ahead and uh, let me grab a, uh, something. Hang on. There we go. We'll grab a little stir stick, kind of give it a little swirl around oh and you can see how clumpy and globby that is right there see that see what we're doing well, let's check out what we're doing underneath here you can see the oil still staying on top our materials light still going into the water however clinging on to the water surface these can this material can work for some oil spills and we can go and collect this easy by sifting it off of the top or vacuuming it off the top see how that works beautiful all right now let's check on this other glass we just poured okay look at this our material here though it clings to the oil it clings to that Okay, all right. So now that we've done that, we've agitated it a little. We can see that because of it's so absorbent, it clings and sucks right up to it. Now, let me see if I can get that off of there. Set that aside. Sorry, I don't know how I'm going to do this here. I'll try. All right, so let's pour this right into there. Okay. Now we lift this up. Okay, lift that up. And we can see how the oil is clung to this. There is some oil residue on here. So what we'll do is we'll add just a little bit more. Maybe I didn't have the right combination. But we'll clean this water up and you guys can see it first handed. Okay. And that way you know that it really works. It's all natural. We'll stir this up and agitate it. Let's collect that oil out of there. Get that water out. We'll have some natural organic material in there. Um, however, you can see how fast this stuff really, really works. Then we can take it to another stage if we need to. Um, you can see all the oil in there holding. Wow, just amazing. What the natural wonders of a plant can do, okay? Once again, you can see some dark spots here where the oil, I didn't have enough material on there. It's clinging to the rest of it. So with that, leaving it in there, agitating it a little, making sure it can pick it up and collect. Oh yeah, you can see the oil. Those dark spots are where the remainder oil, I didn't have enough material. So let me get another bowl and we'll 
pour it in another one. Okay, I should have had some more things out here for everybody. I do apologize for that. Okay, so I got another strainer here. And... Let's lift that up. There we go. Now you can see, we don't have oil. We have some little tidbits of material. The oil clumps are in here. You can see the dark spots. Those are where the oil had collected and grabbed on. You can't see that oil sheen any longer. I'm sure some of that sediment is organic material um, going to go down to settle where the organisms can, um, um, enzymes can eat that and decay that raw material. But I don't see any oil left. So what we got here is some natural oil collection and uh, we're working to get it better as you can see it's absorbing it here on this glass here i may throw just a little bit more in and agitate it um, this isn't a crude oil this is a canola oil a little finer refining so might need a little bit more material to really soak it up um, i'll do another video with crude oil but as you can see you can watch it work Look at, look at, absorbing it right in. Look at that. Okay, so call me Derek Cross 